President Marcos arrives in Vietnam for his official state visit. Among the top agenda of the Philippine delegates is to strengthen the maritime cooperation between two countries. Let's get more of the details from this report. President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. has flown to Vietnam for a two-day working visit. The first official state visit of the president to a foreign country this 2024. During the send-off ceremony, President Marcos once again said that one of his priorities in his official state visit is to strengthen the strategic partnership between two countries, including maritime cooperation, also in defense, security, education, tourism, trade and investment, among others. Uh, one of the cornerstones of the strategic partnership which we are going to forge and that we hope to strengthen this aspect during my visit to promote peace and stability in our region. I will also discuss cooperation in defense and security, trade and investments, education, tourism, as well as regional and multilateral issues of concern. Three Vietnamese leaders are scheduled to meet with the PBBM in Vietnam, including Vietnamese President Vu Van Tung, Prime Minister Pham Minh Chin, and Chairman of the National Assembly Vong Dinh Nhu. There are 39 signed agreements between the Philippines and Vietnam in many aspects, but it is said that the President also includes a meeting with the business sectors in the said country to strengthen the relationship between the two countries in trade and investment in the post-pandemic world. I will also meet with the business sector to explore how we can further strengthen trade and investments between the Philippines and Vietnam. I strongly believe that we have a vast array of opportunities, especially in a post-pandemic world. 7,000 Filipinos are being hosted in Vietnam and have some remittances with more than 13.68 million U.S. dollars. The Philippines and Vietnam have a long withstanding relationship for 47 years after signed an agreement on July 12, 1976. The strategic partnership between the Philippines and Vietnam has furthered strengthened in 2015. Alvin Pelobello for Euro TV News.